What's up guys, I'm Levi with Little Racing Gaming and we've got more Heroes Clash card reveals. Today we're going to be going all over these new Izuku Midoriya cards, everyone's favorite Deku. Starting off with this ultra rare wind up punch. This is a huge punch attack with huge powerful abilities that gets even stronger and even easier to play the more your rival just builds foundations and plays the game. Also interacting beautifully with all of the Dekus to get a Big, big stun too. Next up guys, we have an asset for Deku. Look how cool this is, y'all. It's literally Deku's notebook from the anime. It's pretty expensive to get into play, but once it is, you can remove it, your rival reveals their hand, and you can change the zone of your attack. Hey, I noticed you don't have a low block there. Let me just make this a nice low attack. This is gonna be so big for Deku. And now trading our order out for Earth, we have a card, another attack under Deku, two symbols, forceful blow. This is a big damage attack with a big, powerful, powerful potential. And then when your opponent does block it, I mean, they have to, right? When it's packing powerful four, you get to pick up any spam foundation from your discard pile. This is so sick. And I mean, look at look at the art. I feel bad just covering even a little bit of this art. And then lastly, we have Lessons from Taiyaki, a really powerful control option for Deku that can cancel your rival's next enhance abilities alongside a powerful deadlock to just pick up any of the attacks you've already played this turn. Can't help but notice we've traded out the void symbol as well on this card. Is this a nod to Gran Torino's Owen Taiyaki card or are we getting a Deku with void in the near future? That's it for today guys, but check back tomorrow for more Heroes Clash reveals and if you want more MHACCG content, subscribe to my YouTube and follow me on Twitter down below.